Welcome, my darlings. You are on Bruno's Guitar Garage. I would like to show you how fortunate I am to actually have a garage now. This is where I will be doing all the videos. That's mine. That's motorcycle gear, which I gave a very hearty coating of beeswax to earlier today, which is a real chore, so let's hope it works. That's some shelves with not my stuff on it. That is a very old Aria. So old, in fact, that it's branded Ariana. It's a Matsumoku guitar. It is very, very bellied. So eventually I will get to that. I don't know when, but I'll get to it. That's my acoustic, my Ibanez Performer. That's the spaceship, which is almost done, and I promise I'll do something about that. <laughs> There's the old U30, Studio 20, Origin 50. There's some tools. There's a jack. That little half-size guitar belongs to my, my beloved's old man, who loves it so much he put a billion-dollar Fishman pickup in it. It was very messy, so I brought it back to life. It's my 85 SD1. Some canola oil? What the fuck? Sunflower oil. Like, oh, that'll be for the barbecue. Yeah, that's in the uh, Roland video. Now, as you can see, there's a bench grinder here. The Explorer and my base. There's a bunch of tools. There's a cheese grater, which I should probably put back in the kitchen. There's a bench here with a soldering iron. That's some of my darlings. A Jansen isn't mine. None of that stuff is mine, except darlings. There's a very old SV650 here. And some other stuff. And a Ducati jacket that smells really weird. <laughs> Right, so all of this stuff here, well, not that, but all of this stuff, all the bench, this is all my stuff, because you may or may not be aware that I try to bring guitars back to life as well. Hence the very old Matsumoku guitar sitting here. This is where all of that magic happens. So I have my parts bin. Uh, Off-brand WD-40, a lamp that kind of ate the bulb. That was really scary, that exploded. It was pretty cool, but it was kind of scary. I didn't see it coming. Toolbox. Um, let's put that down there for the time being. One of these things, which is very, very useful, which my flatmates got me some years ago. Of course, I've added to it. This has everything you need to do. Everything you need to do. Everything you are going to need to look after a guitar. It comes with some polishes and shit like that too. Capo is good for doing neck relief, things like that. A lot of clever wee tools in there, very useful. Came with the mat, the mat's upside down so it doesn't get guff on it. Um, came with that, which is a neck holding thingy. Blah blah blah. Behind there is an old Yamaha Budokan, Budokan, some Japanese name. Aussie played there, that's pretty cool. PV Viper Tube 60, which I will get to, it's a very fascinating amp. But yeah, I can hang shit from the ceiling, and over there. This is it. This is Bruno's Guitar Garage. Bruno still lives up north with my parents. But this is it. I'm very, very grateful and very, very fortunate to have this space to do my things in. Thought you might like to know. Take care now.